Alright, hi there. So uh, now we are going to uh, introduce the uh, AQL table. Uh, this uh, AQL table uh, is a table that is commonly used to uh, determine the sampling size of a product. Uh, of a product. So uh, it is worth to take note that uh, normally the AQL table is a uh, you need to use for end products or raw materials uh, instead of in process. Uh, later you will get to see why. Uh, so uh, first of all, uh, you, you may see this table over here. You may see this, uh, the normal AQL table. Uh, there on the left, there is the lot size. This lot size is the total amount of products being made. Total amount of the products being made. And then there are these uh, few inspection levels for us to refer to. Uh, normally for uh, industries, common industries, we normally use uh, general inspection level 2. Uh. So uh, in this level, we just look at this line. Uh, the, when, uh, the more, the more, how to say, the more the column, when the column moves to the left, uh, more siding to the left, it means uh, it is a uh, more stringent uh, inspection level. So, so uh, and then the table below will, will help you decide the amount of sample size that you need to take okay you need to take and then uh, how many let's say how many rejects uh, we can accept for the set sample size oh so uh, we can have some example over here uh, let's say let's say for the first example we count by pieces uh, pieces let's say i make uh, for this lot i make 5000 or 5000 pieces of uh, let's say bags uh, 5000 pieces of bags and then, so when say 5,000, we look at this file beside here. So 5,000 is in between uh, here, here, 3, 2, 0, 1 to 10,000. Uh, 5,000 is in between here. Therefore, as for just now, I mentioned that uh, we are going to use inspect general inspection level 2. So you, when it's level 2, it should be at the letter L. Okay, you can see it's the letter L. Yeah. So remember the letter L and then we move down uh, this letter L here. So when it's L, immediately you will see that uh, there's a sample size. That means out of 5,000 products we make, we need to sample 200 pieces of bag. Okay, 200 pieces of bag. Now we need to find out the, what is the acceptable level. So uh, just to highlight the normal level used by most uh, plastic or rubber industries is 0.65. 0.65 oh. so uh, 0.65 means that uh, after inspection they can you can still accept a uh, 0.65 percent uh, uh, of uh, non-conforming items in your total product so that means it's not a perfect inspection but there is no perfect sampling and inspection so again the more it's more to the left the more stringent it is so like just now uh, we were at L 200 so out of 200 samples we take for inspection we look under the column of 0 0.65 we can see two and three okay two and three eh, sorry not two and three three and four three and four zero point six five so it means that among the 200 samples you take if there are three or less rejects you still can accept the whole lot and this lot can be given to the customer okay if three or below rejects and you can accept the whole lot but if it's four and above that means you have to reject the whole lot no? so below three is accept above four rejects is uh, you need to on hold the whole lot okay well you see but logically logically speaking uh, if you want to sample 200 pieces it's very tedious so many other places they will do by box how many cartons you have uh, uh, you have made no? so for instance for instance uh, let's say you have made 80 cartons, okay, 80 cartons, right, 80 cartons. So totally 80 cartons. We, we do not care how many pieces of bags are in one carton. We just assume it's 80. Then uh, 80, we look at here, is 51 to 90. So 80 is in between. We look at, again, we look at general inspection level E, level 2, E. So we go down to E, and then E says that uh, you need to sample uh, 13. Okay, 13 boxes. Uh, what 13 boxes mean? You need to check a whole lot of things inside the carton, or almost all. You know? So when it's 13, 
uh, and just now remember is uh, we should accept 0 0.65 so 13 we look uh, horizontally okay you will reach uh, an arrow la. an arrow means uh, when the arrow is pointing down means asking you to it's asking you to refer below so you take 13 samples 13 cartons and then you check if there is any carton within the carton uh, that has reject that means you have to reject the whole lot la. like if it's zero means all except all except means okay automatically but if there's one reject that means you have to uh, reject all so uh, it is fully up to you to decide actually uh, which acceptance quantity limit quality limit that you will uh, you, you will uh, use as your standard but uh, just to say most companies will use uh, 0 0.65 and as above is the inspection and level 2 okay so hope it helps uh, thank you